So today you guys, Ryan's back on a rampage uh, and today we're in Leicester at Houston Street Police Station just there is where the emergency vehicles come out I've been in this cop shop as well um, a couple of times I'd say um, and it's not only me that has a problem with the way the cells are kept it is other people as well uh, there's been reports of dirty meal plates being left um, in the cell three of them in one cell um, the staff was emailed to clean up in a timely fashion um, and yeah other complaints toilets not flushing um, I mean there's a couple that, that you can consider as like you know what I mean no, like no lid on the toilet, fair enough, you can't go for a dump then. Um, but you know, smaller complaints like that, but they all build up as one. Um, and yeah, just the way this, this cells are real cold, even in the summer, they're quite cold. Um, it's just like they're trying to freeze us out. Um, and again, like I say, I've been, I've been in this police station a couple of times. Um, I know they're a bit rough with people, so I've got a body cam as well today. Um, so if I do get approached, that will be turned on. Um, and yeah, this is where they release you from, this door here. This is the waiting area uh, when you're waiting for your lift home. Um, or so forth. But when you do, you do come in, you come in along that road. Um, and straight round the back to where you've seen them cars. Uh, and yeah, guys, cells in here are disgusting. The way they treat some people is like they're judging jewelry straight away as well. Um, if you end up getting arrested and brought to this police station, you know why you've been treated like crap because of the work out of this police station. It's not just this police station, um, but plenty more do it as well. But uh, it's this one I'm highlighting today. And yeah. They arrested me for something I didn't do, but it's legit guys, I didn't do it. Um, but it already felt like I did do it at the time of arrest. Um, so, yeah, this is Euston Street Police Station in Leicester, um, near the industrial estate. Um, as you can see, parked vehicle, parked vehicle, and then a sign in between both of them. No parking, keep clear. And that's our police force in Leicester. Um, yeah, like, that's kind of bizarre. We've got a swipe card down low, up high here, quite a way away from the gate. Um, but yeah, like, no parking right there, and there's one two police vehicles um, and that's meant to be kept clear but there we have it guys police authority listens that's two little piggies bit of beat Oh, and we're getting approached. Hello. You alright? Uh, just recording, love. Because I can. Because you can? Yep. Right, so for what reason? Have you not got anything better to do each time? Um, I've got plenty of things, and this is just one of them. Why? Because I can. It's a government building. 
So obviously you're going to draw some attention, aren't you? That's fine. That's why we're here to speak to you. So. Don't worry, there's no malice. That's yeah. it, I'm just recording. And then that's it, done. Any so. reason why you're recording? Not that I need to explain, it's just for myself really. For yourself? Yeah. Yep. Is that recording as well, is it? That is, yes. What's your name, mate? I'm not going to give that. You're not going to give it? No. Have you been around to other stations? I have. <laughs> not willing. Not willing because I'm not obliged to. If I'm obliged to, that's a different story, but I'm not obliged to. I'm not going to give them. Am I obliged to give them my, give you my details? Well, I'm just asking you because we're having a conversation, aren't we? No, that's, so. a, that's fine. I'll stay anonymous, thank you. Okay. Well, so we don't want you, obviously, filming certain parts of the building for obvious reasons. Right. So we're going to be here until you move along, basically. In essence, is there a reason? I, I just, I, I'm a bit confused as to why you're here. You didn't have to walk that close behind me, did you? <laughs> don't worry me like that. <laughs> what's, your, what, I don't, what's your issue? Because you're clearly I have just no, a bit on edge. And I have no issue, he just walked rather close to me. I've been treated like dirt by police before, so, you know. Why are you here then? If you don't like us, I, if this was the last place I'd be if I didn't like police. Well, some people are a little bit more crazy than others. Would you mind to speak to you? That's fine, there's no malice. So you can be here but to I speak to me. I mean, I you, you say there's no malice, but you've got to appreciate I've got a room full of colleagues upstairs with a lot of people that don't like police officers, so this is the reason why we're here, because I'm here to protect myself, my colleagues, and other members of the public that are going to be entering the police station, because you can imagine you're drawing some attention by walking around a police station car park with a camera. I don't understand what the problem is with the camera. If, if, I was to, if I was to come here, I've, I've actually done it previously, mm. walk around a police station without a camera, mm. nothing gets said, but with a camera, where there's stacks of evidence that I'm not doing anything illegal, mm -hmm. then police have a problem with it. No, I'd have a problem. If you were standing that close to the gates as you were, I'd have a problem with that, for sure. Because why are you doing it? If you are and you're at a police station... That's because I was just explaining, when you get arrested, that's, that's the route round you go, and then back out that way. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying to you. I would, with or without a camera, I would be approaching you and asking you what you were doing and why. The, the, the conversation we'd have it, whether you've got a camera or not, uh, we would be having this conversation because I'll be honest with you, I've worked here for a very long time and I've, I've not seen anybody do that before, so it's come as uh, something very new to myself. And it'd be wrong if we hadn't come down to speech, you wouldn't it really? If someone was on, your, on, on land where you were working or whatever, you didn't recognise them, wouldn't know what they were up to, you'd, you'd do the same thing. That's fine. Right say? Yeah. Yeah? Can I have your name and badge numbers, please? Of course you can. 1414 Chloe Oliver. 546 Daisy Sword. Thank you very much. So what was your plan? Just to film the building? Yep, pretty much. I mean, the longer you guys are stood here wasting the police time, um, the longer I'm going to be stood here, pretty much. Is there any intention behind it? Are you filming for somebody, for something, just for yourself? Just for you, myself. You don't have to just it's just... No, I know I don't have to disclose, but obviously you can, I, I understand why it's a problem and why I always get approached with a camera, yeah. but the thing is, I always explain that little bit, so then you understand sort of what I'm doing, mm -hmm. not that I need to tell you everything. So that's literally the only reason why I've told you anything anyway, otherwise I could just stood, stood here quiet, which I've done at several police stations previously. Is there anything you want from us? Anything we can help you with? Anything? Um, one question, if you could answer it, are the cells clean now? Are the cells clean now? Yeah, after the complaints that have been made and okay. the the online, you know, it's been it's been all over the papers that, yeah, that you, you can't clean inside, they can't clean the cells properly. Well, there are cleaners that, that, that the cells are clean between each suspect. Um, if that's the view you hold, it's not what I've been told. There's been evidence of it, and it's in the news and online. And there was there was at one point three um, meal plates left in a cell when somebody got arrested and put in that cell. 
Um, We're not going to obviously so. discuss the internet. So if you want to make a complaint about the state of the cells, that's you're more than entitled to do so. By oh, it's already it's already been made a complaint. It's already it's already full, public knowledge. Well, yeah, but I can give you the false details if you want to, um, St John's. So if you want me to do that, I can um, provide you with those, um, or you can go about it, doing it on the false website. That's, that, okay. that's how we go about it. Obviously, we can't investigate our colleagues. That's not how it works. The department does that. So no, if you're not okay. happy with the conditions of the cells or the conditions of the police station in general, then you're more than welcome to. And I'd encourage that. So Right, okay, thank you. Alright. Alright, thank you. Like I said, the longer you're gonna be here wasting police time, the longer I'm gonna be stood here I'm just not wasting police time. Bye. You, you are, you could be out catching real criminals, couldn't you? Well, we don't know who we, we are, we don't know who you're up to. We don't know you're not, we know you're not. Like I said, I'm just gonna record and then that's it. Done. If if I was if I was committing any criminal offence then surely you would have arrested me by now. So we like to engage with members of the public. Fair enough, but still, at the end of the day, the longer you stand here, the longer you're wasting police time. We're just engaging with you, that's all. That's, I'm more than entitled to do that. That's my job, engage with people. Okay, that's, that's fine. I'm just explaining the longer you stood there, the longer I'm when you stood here. I'm not, I'm not obviously with you. We'll go in when, when, when we want to go in. It's not a problem. Um, I'm obviously just back up with colleagues and people coming out of the building. I don't know who you are because you've got a reason to not give us your details because you don't want to, um, as you please. So whilst I know that there's possibly a shift coming, I'll stay here to protect my colleagues because that's also my job. Oh, there's a shift change, Tom. Change is shift patterns. That's funny, I got left in a cell for an hour without nothing. Okay. No problem. I'm not going to tell you that. Does it sound like I am? Does it sound like I am? People have various accents around here, so... <laughs> I know that, but it, does it sound like I'm a typical young man from Leicester? I haven't got any judgments on what the typical is in Leicester. I just thought I had a strong Leicester accent. Yeah, no problem. If you could assign us to the job that we were going to before this, um, we will pick that up. No, that's it, Tom. No, anything, anything further I could be assistance with. Oh, do you want the, um, the address for us to complain into? I've got all that already. Oh, all perfect. Yep. Leicester Police, you'll find it on if you type into Google or another search engine that's readily available, I'm sure you'll be able to. I already have all the details of each police station before I attend. Perfect. All right, well, we'll leave you to it. Um, go and enjoy the sun. Yeah. I will do. Thank you. You're dismissed. So there you have it guys, uh, turn my body cam off now, it's currently not needed, uh, back to my camera, and yeah, they're not going to disclose any details of um, anything, but obviously they've got real criminals to be going catching now, which is why they've uh, gone off, they've been called to a job, um, and yeah. That's it guys, obviously Euston Street Police Station, um, obviously this is all at the front, the cells are at the back where you've seen the cars earlier, um, and yeah guys, quite quite polite in Leicester to be fair, I thought I was going to get accosted quite a lot in Leicester, because um, it's where I'm from, um, 
my past experiences with police have not been that nice from Leicester um, so yeah <coughs> I'm quite I'm quite happy with that I'm quite happy with that although they did try a couple of times to get my details um, which I, I will not give I will never give um, unless I am going to be arrested or then again I'll just take the arrest um, it's as simple as that because I know I'm not doing any um, anything criminal um, or any, any, causing any malice so I will happily decline um, and yeah like I say guys Leicestershire Police um, let me know what you guys think of that down in the comments um, and yeah Ryan's on a rampage again well like I say guys that's uh, Euston Street Police Station um, body cam footage as well because I, I know what these guys can be like they've been very rough with me previously but maybe that's because they was just arresting me they, they decided they could be rough that day um, or whatever ever that was um, so yeah guys um, stay tuned for the next one and peace That's inside guys, again anything you can see from a public place. And that's what I can see, well that's what my camera can pick up. So I will happily pick that up. And yeah guys. Guys, I've been stood here for a couple of minutes now, right, and I swear they're meant to close before the car leaves, unless it's an emergency. Obviously, no blues and twos, and the gates are still wide open. Anyone could gain access at that point. Like, how long until they actually close? We'll see. Yeah, about five minutes, mate. <laughs> about five minutes. I think we need to get a better uh, timer on the uh, gates. But there we have it. <laughs>